I'm Jessica Payne, the uh, Director for Digital Strategy at PAN, and as promised, I wanted to give you my takeaway from the PR News Digital Summit. So I've put together three of my very top tips, uh, so I'm going to walk you through these. So basically, when it comes to digital marketing and PR, um, there's a lot going on. So, but one of the biggest things coming out of the conference was uh, the importance of the power of influence. And what I mean by that is, you know, if you're thinking about content or influence, um, you know, what really gets people, uh, what gets people's attention? How are you going to drive action? So think about things like turning content into something visual, or putting out um, a call to action, something that's clear and explainable, and actually ask the website visitor or app user to do something. And keep in mind things like uh, the way the website looks, um, how a video sounds, or the visuals you're using, and how important that is to actually make some, someone do something as easy as clicking to the next page. So remember that, power of influence. The second uh, tip is actually how to get more mileage out of your content. You know, 2012 was the year of content, but 2013 is really going to be the year of uh, prioritizing that content, how you distribute it. And what I mean by that is, one thing I learned at the conference was content, uh, especially white papers and newsletters, are read more during the morning and evening commute. So if you're going to distribute something or do some thought leadership, why don't you think about posting during those times so that your content is read the most. Uh, the last tip um, has to do with everyone's favorite, free tools. There's a lot of premium tools out there, but someone might not have the budget. So why don't you take a look at what's free and use those. Google Analytics is your best friend. You can do everything from understand website behavior to um, you know how many blog referrals you're driving through the website, for example. Um, but also take a look at some third-party apps like TweetReach or Topsy. Those are proving to be very, very valuable in tracking real-time uh, engagement or just what the heck you're doing on Twitter. So those are my three top tips. Uh, for more, definitely follow the PanCom Twitter handle and um, more information soon. Thanks.